This is the experiment heart rate and body position. It's lab number 25 in the middle school science with Vernier book. And we're going to do it with a hand grip heart rate monitor connected directly to a LabQuest using LabQuest app. The hand grip heart rate monitor uh, is composed of this piece, which is the receiver, which I'm going to plug into channel one of the LabQuest. And then these hand grips where you will hang on to them and they will record the heart rate. So I'm going to have my volunteer come in now. Come on in and have a seat. And hold these like that, placing your fingers in the positions marked. I'm going to hold the receiver so that the arrow on the receiver lines up with the arrow on the transmitters that he's holding. Uh, the first thing I need to do is do one little change on the LabQuest app. The default rate and length for the hand grip heart rate monitor is 25 samples per second and a length of 600 seconds. We need to lengthen that to 720 seconds, so I'll tap on the length and change that 600 to 720 and say OK. OK, it looks like we're ready to go, so I'm just going to tap on Collect. Now on the heart rate monitor, you're going to see that data doesn't come in right away. It takes several seconds for some data to be collected so that the first rate can be averaged and plotted on the, the graph. So you'll see the spinning, that's normal, but after maybe 10, 15 seconds, there's our first spot right there. We can see the heart rate is 76 beats per minute, and that's normal. And now he's going to stay in this position for four minutes. Then he's going to lay down on the ground for four minutes, and then stand up for four minutes. And then we'll take a look at our data when we're done. OK, we're just coming up to the end of our four minutes in the standing position. We're just about finished. OK, data collection just finished. And thank you. We can uh, now go to the screen and see our data. And you can actually see the three different heart rates very clearly. This first section was where he was sitting down, a little higher uh, heart rate than in the second section where he was lying on the floor. And then the third section where he stood up is quite a bit higher. We can actually look at the average uh, heart rate for each of these three. And you would do that one at a time. Take your stylus and select a region where he was sitting in the chair. Under Analyze, choose Statistics for heart rate, and you see that the mean heart rate is 63 beats per minute for that first section in the chair. The second section, if I turn the first one off, second section, I'll select a region where he's lying on the floor and calculate the statistics of the heart rate there, and the average is down to 52.5, so we'll around that to 53 beats per minute during the part where he was lying on the floor, so quite a bit slower. Turn those off. And then in the third section, we'll select a region here where he was standing up. And the statistics for the heart rate there, the heart rate was all the way up to 84 beats per minute. So you can see it does take quite a bit more uh, heart pumping for the standing position than either of the other two. So that's a really good sample there of how your heart has to work harder when you're standing up than when you're sitting down or lying down. And it's just one of several uh, experiments for the hand grip heart rate sensor in the middle school with Vernier Lab book.